Hello boys and girls, today I'm going to tell you about Naomi and Ruth and Orpah. But the important characters we have here are Naomi and Ruth. This is Naomi and she lived with her two daughters-in-law, Orpah and Ruth. Here's Orpah and here's Ruth. They were the only they were the only people left in their household because their men's men had gone off to fight in a war. Even when times were hard because a famine hit the land, the three women were always happy living together and they did their best to take care of each other. Girls, Naomi said one day, I've been thinking life is better where the rest of my family lives. Let's go there. So Naomi wanted to take her girls and go on a journey. So they packed all of their things and started to walk, more walking. Plod, plod, plod. It was long and thirsty and dusty walk. Halfway there, Naomi turned to Orpah and Ruth, and she said, she said to them, I am only your mother-in-law, not your mom. You should go back and live with your own mothers. And with that, Naomi kissed them goodbye. But Orpah and Ruth cried and cried. Boo-hoo! We don't want to go back. We want to stay with you. Naomi argued with them. That doesn't make any sense. Go back without me and start your lives over. Dab, dab. Orpah dried her tears on her face and turned around the dusty path and headed for home. There goes Orpah. But Ruth said to Naomi, I can't leave you, Ruth said. I will go wherever you go. I will live wherever you live. Your people are now going to become my people, and your God is going to be become, become my God. Ruth loved no, Naomi no matter what, just like God loves us no matter what. Naomi saw that Ruth meant what she said. All right, Naomi smiled. And they started walking again, plod, plod, plod. When Naomi's family saw her coming, they welcomed her with open arms. They shouted, hooray, and ran to hug her and Ruth. Welcome home, they cried. Naomi and Ruth started a new life together, caring for, you, for each other just as God had cared for them on their journey. So I have a question for all of you to think about. Would you have acted more like Orpah and turned around and got home? Or would you have gone, or like Ruth, who turned around and went back to her mother-in-law who loved her even after her husband was gone? Why? Think about that.